Hi, it's Dr. Donna. Welcome to week 47. Let's get started. Last week's book was all about product innovation and the strategies that winning companies use to get on top and stay on top. The concept that resonated the most with me was strategic leverage. Of course, you want to know what that is. Think about it this way. When I was growing up, the movie E.T. was extremely popular when it came out. One of the brands that was associated with E.T. was Reese's Pieces, and they became synonymous. But think about the movie. First we had the movie, then we had all of the E.T. products that came along after that. The game, the Halloween costumes, the toys, the pajamas, everything came from E.T. And then when it had its 25th anniversary, all those products resonated with everybody once again. The goal is to take one concept and turn it into multiple concepts. Get on top of it, get a product that you can innovate, partner with someone, and the next thing you know, you're gonna be winning over and over and over and over again. That is how you create strategic leverage. Last week's TED Talk was all about market disruption and innovation, and you know, those are some of my favorite concepts. The part that resonated with me the most was at the end when the speaker said, take everything that you learn and everything that you're working on and partner with other people to change the world. And as one of my favorite idols of all time, Mr. Steve Jobs says, you got to put a dent in the universe. What does that mean? That means take everything that you're working on, all your innovative ideas that some people are saying are sucky and awful and don't pay attention to them. Partner with like-minded people and change the world. This week's book, Our Iceberg is Melting. It's a parable. I think I'm falling in love with these parables. This week's TED Talk, What Makes a Good Life? And as I always say, when you can see it and you can read it, then you can believe it and most certainly you can achieve it. Au revoir.